We are here this morning to address the problematic actions of the Canada Border Services Agency regarding the denial of refugee status and protection to individuals affiliated with the Freedom and Justice Party in Egypt. The FJP is a political party in Egypt that was founded after the 2011 Egyptian Revolution. The party was dissolved in 2014 after the military coup that ousted President Mohamed Morsi. Since then, members of the FJP have faced persecution in Egypt, with many forced to flee the country. More than 4,000 Egyptians, including many party members, and even some in leadership positions, have sought refuge in Canada successfully. Thousands of these people have been accepted by CBSA across this country, but a handful have not. I'm here today to uh, release a letter that I've written to the Minister of uh, Public Safety, Minister Marco Mendicino, and I'm asking him to issue a directive to all CBSA officers across Canada stating that mere membership in the Freedom and Justice Party is not in and of itself a ground for inadmissibility, but that further evidence of misconduct must be called upon in order to ground a fair process for these people. And I'm also calling on him to emphasize to CBSA to treat all refugee claimants in a fair and consistent manner, free from discrimination. Since 2013, there's been a large scale of repressive and punitive measures and a broader climate of fear triggered for those who oppose the Egyptian regime. The government of Canada and Canadians supported the 2011 revolution, recognized and worked with the first democratically elected government. Across Canada, the CBSA has acknowledged the sacrifices of Egyptians in their home country and current persecutions they face by the military regime. These families have spent the last five years contributing to Canada. They should have the right to become a part of the Canadian community, to be protected and to become citizens. I, I, I see my family is destroyed. Every one of my family has a, a, a lot of difficulties. My children couldn't uh, catch university. Everything in our life is destroying. We have a, a very bad financial. I couldn't uh, get any training with government to take a suitable job for my, uh, uh, my age and my health because I haven't any agreement in Canada. So that I believe, I feel that I am in a big prison. I couldn't visit my children in Turkey and I couldn't do anything for my children. 